Hey guys, good morning. We have a really, really, really fun day planned. So let's go ahead and get the morning and get the day started off right. We're gonna do my morning routine. I think I look like an old person. <laughs> it just doesn't go together. But I don't love it. Alright, today's fun outfit. I'm sticking to what I know and what I love, which is this vest from the consignment store. Long sleeve. This one is actually from like Gander Mountain. It's for layers for hunting and everything. Um, I forgot what they're called. Long johns. And then jeans are from the consignment store. I think they're clothes though. And then socks are Nike. I just, I didn't want to be too hot, but then I didn't want to be too cold. That's why the other outfits just didn't fit. <laughs> Notice anything different? Finally home. It's been a long day. I left at like nine. Got there 45 minutes early. She got there about 15-ish minutes after I did. So then we started my hair early. The massage, oh my gosh. I'll talk about it in a minute, but it's amazing. So home hair salon, McDonald's, because I downloaded the app because dad said I should, because they have like offers like rewards and everything so the first time you download it and they claim your offer you have 15 minutes to like redeem that offer basically so they give you a four digit code and i wanted the one with free fries with a purchase over a dollar so i just got a large iced coffee because that's what i wanted anyway i was like fries have been sounding so good recently so i got a large fry i already ate it all I ate in the car after mcdonald's i went to the credit union i didn't plan on going there but i was like well i'm out anyway i'm on the highway so i just went there and i dropped off my monthly the money i put into my savings account yeah, and now I'm finally home. <sighs> I have a headache. I've had a headache since I went there. First of all, my hair smells amazing just from all the products like used on it and it just feels so good. So when I booked this appointment, I literally booked it two days ago. It was very on a whim. And let me just go to say, obviously I have money in my savings account, but I try to not spend that money unless I like have to. Obviously, I don't have to do anything, but um, you know, unless I don't have cash on me or in my debit or like checking account on my debit card i'm not letting that get below a certain number and that number's in my head and it's 60 dollars away from that number but i will be making money soon so i obviously didn't babysit this week and i only babysat once last week and i usually sit twice at least every single week so i'll be babysitting a few days and i will be replenishing my savings account but in the meantime i really wanted to wait until like i had more money like saved up to get my hair done but i was like you know what i kind of just want it now i kept um looking for salons like i wanted to find a really really good salon and i found this one a Amazing reviews and I looked at the availability and everything and there was one for today and I was like, you know, what? let me do it I online booked it as a balayage 
which was $90 starting price, and haircut, which is $31, so $121. Or I think total was $131. Anyway, but you don't pay online because you pay when you're there because that's just the starting price. Anyway, when I got there, I basically said that I I showed her inspiration pictures that I found off of Pinterest, which is what I'm going to show you guys. I don't know if they're focusing, but these are the pictures I showed her. First of all, I said, I don't even know if any of these are like similar because to me they look similar. They're all darker shades of brown with like a little bit lighter in them like to a hairstyle she'd be like oh this one's the darkest this is the lightest these are kind of similar these are and this is why you know what i mean like i was like these look similar to me but are they to you anyway so i said i wanted something like that and then i said i wanted a haircut about two inches off face frame and some layers in the back first of all face frame i love it especially with my curly hair obviously she curled my hair both my naturally curly hair which isn't this curly i think the face frames will look so good and i love how they look with curls on them the layers i also love and i love how like i just love the length of my hair right now the color i don't know when i first got it done like sitting in the salon with like the harsh lighting and everything i didn't love it because i couldn't really tell a difference and now that i went outside into the natural lighting i can definitely see a difference in my hair i don't think this is exactly what i was going in for i don't it's not what I was going in for. I wanted my hair color to be darker, but Bali as you don't use foils and we did use foils So I don't know exactly what we did But when shearing up the lady said that balayage and haircut whatever anyway, it was $144 um, Without tip. I don't know if I would spend that much on my hair I mean th the thing is I am so big with where my money goes and I don't like spending money But I haven't got my hair done. The last time I got my hair done was like three at least years ago and I got highlights done and I told her I had highlights before but now I want to go darker with my hair the thing is when I'm looking at my hair right now after it's done I'm like what's my natural hair color like did she put lighter into it or did she put darker into it like I can't tell anymore <laughs> that's the thing I don't know but I wanted more ashy rather than like a golden it was super nice I was in there for three and a half hours I love when they wash your hair and they're just like Oh my gosh, that feels so good. And I just love like the smell of all the products they use, like the shampoo, conditioner, toner, just everything. I would say it's a good experience. I think it's worth it and it's something that makes me feel better. I don't know why I'm trying to justify it. I'm just like, wow, that was a lot of money, but it's okay because I have money saved. I'm gonna make more money. Money comes and goes. We're okay, we're thriving. Anyway, I made more coffee just in this cup because there's already coffee in this cup. Mm. I actually do like it though. I know I said that this isn't exactly what I was looking for, but once I got a sign in the natural lighting, I was like, wow, I actually really like how my hair looks. So although it's not exactly the darkness that I wanted, I like it a lot. I love it. Yesterday was the first day in like three days that I finally read, and I only read one chapter just because it was like super late. But I at least wanted to read something to get me back into reading. I'm currently reading Variety by Colleen Hoover. And like I said, I'm only one chapter in and it was so good. I wanted to read more, but the next chapter was 23 pages. And I was like, oh, I need to go to bed right now. I finally got eight and a half hours sleep yesterday, which was perfect. So I haven't gotten that in like a week. But I'm gonna go ahead and read the second chapter and then I need to do some YouTube work. It's almost 3 p.m. So I will be home any minute here. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Hello. How are you? I'm good, how are you? We just got home from the beach. Is that nice out? Yes, it is. It's only 80, Grandpa says. Did you get your hair lightened? <laughs> yeah, I got it done today. Very nice. I was waiting for you to notice. Do you like it? Yes, it looks very nice. <laughs>